that are here. Holiness, pure, clean, perfect, infallible holiness. Holiness, rough, hard, flawless, rock, infallible, yes, holiness. Holiness is your thoughts, your rules, your doctrine, and your regulation. In order to reflect you, I must take on your character. Yes, I must be exposed to it. Holiness is your intelligence, your will, and your status. Holiness, the standard perpetual laws that goes from everlasting to everlasting. Holiness has no beginning. It has no ending. It just keeps on going and going. Holiness, before the Lord made the clouds his chariot, and before he sends out the heavens as a curtain, holiness was. Holiness remains where heaven and earth moves. Holiness, it breaks you, it forms you, it creates you, it elevates you into a holy people. Holiness, undefiled, upright, righteous, always right holiness always was and always is before the foundation of the world and before the mountains lift their nose towards heaven holiness was holiness before the firmament was placed in the midst of the deep and before the lord gave the sea her decree holiness was Holiness is the total submission unto God. So, whom would you liken him unto? Who is my equal? Say the Holy One. I'm higher than heaven, deeper than hell, broader than the sea, and longer than the earth. If I cut you off and shut you up, who can stop me? Who is it that bound the wind in his fist and then placed the waters in his garments? It is written, what is his name, if thou can tell? Who is it that ride upon the wings of the wind, walk in some the curse of the heavens, and spread about the north over an empty place, then hangs the earth on nothing? He alone made the world by his power, established the world by his wisdom, and stretched forth the heavens by his understanding. He even gave the sea her decree. He shaketh the earth out of her place and layeth the chambers in the waters, then commanded the sun to rise not, then sealeth of the stars thereof. Who is it that has his way in the whirlwind and in the storm? Tell me who, that by him the mountains quake and the earth burns at his presence. By his breath frost is given and by watering he burned the thick clouds. He roared and thundered marvelously with his great voice. Great things does it he which we cannot comprehend.